Hi, my name is Dan Groverson. In this video I'll show you how you can use the PI documentation tool to document your mapping and get some more insight in how they're working. So first off we have a mapping here and we press somewhere in, in the mapping press control shift and then zero and we get this uh, drop down box and we can then say export message mapping and we export it to a folder and just say all right well it doesn't matter that much and then we open the browser and we go to this website um, you can get it just going to ficaf.com and go to to products and pi document and fill in your name name, name your name and email there so we select the mapping uh, just and it's just here and we select it 2007 is okay it's the same for excel it works at least with 2000 excel to 2000 and then we can actually see the mapping here we can see all the information software component the object ddd when it was changed and a lot of other things and we can see how each mapping element is mapped and how it's changed so if we write a comment here and a comment for, for this mapping customer name it's probably one of the things you don't want to be typing when you're doing demos. Um, as you can see we have saved this one now. <laughs> Obviously you are often doing changes in your mapping so let's just do a small change here. Uh, just do change this one and uh, just have the, the substring part of it one or fifth. I don't know if that would make any sense. But let's just say it for the sake of this exercise. We can save the mapping now. And we can export it again. Let's call this one two. Okay. So what happens now is we can go into the tool again and this time we can so we'll select the mapping two and then we will select the um, file that we have just created so it's just down here and we can say generate documentation and now we I hope that we should get the same document again it will be number six I think but this time it has remembered the comments that we put earlier. The comments is attached to the customer name uh, to the the path of this one. So if you m move anything else or add other values, they sh would still be cha available. One other thing that is right quite interesting is if you're doing your your term your you really don't know what is the difference between these two mappings. It's often the case that you just get, well, we changed something, what's the difference? And, well, we can see this one part is different. And we can see out here that there's a yes. So this will actually help you getting to know what are the differences between two mappings and you can just put a filter on here and just say and come on oh of course we need to activate editing because it's downloaded and we'll just say all oh, that's yes and we see it's only this one so it is really easy to get started using and you can actually use this for <laughs> a lot of things in, in that perspective so I uh, hope that this helped you Bye.